we've learned with profound sadness this morning Uganda's High Commissioner to Kenya and Sicily's Dr. Hassan Kaliwango died this morning in Nairobi, Kenya. We regret to announce to the country that he has passed on, but we want to extend our sincere heartfelt condolences. The NRM Deputy Secretary General erased the late Dr. Hassan Kaliwango, who once served at the NRM Secretariat as Director for Finance and Administration. He has served this country in various capacities and the party. He has been a seasoned politician. He has been a pillar of the party, not only in Bugisu sub-region, but also here at, at the Secretariat. He held fort the Secretariat here even before we came here as full-time workers. Dr. Hassan Galiwango was appointed ambassador in 2021. The NRM now accords him a standing ovation. He was an educationist. He has been a, 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 a management Gulu or expert, he has been an external examiner at UMI. He, he has been a philanthropist, really, if I may say. Party members led by the director of mobilization, Rosemary Nansubuka Seninde, said the late Galiwango has reigned and finished his race. He has a very strong hand in the development of the secretariat. He is among the people who really started the development of the secretariat, and he worked here as the director in charge of finance. He also worked as a mobilizer, so he was a very strong mobilizer. He was a very good person that everybody appreciated working with. It's very sad that he's now gone, but of course we cannot forget the legacy he has left behind. Actually to many people in Uganda, it was as if Haji Galiwango was the NRM secretariat. Because he was ever present, he was ever ready to provide answers. Even when there were no resources to give those who wanted them, Dr. Galiwango was available to provide the explanation. The director in charge of communication, Emmanuel Dombo, told this media that the NRM party has lost a tower of humor and knowledge. To us who come from Eastern Uganda, and specifically Mbale, where he comes from, he has been a tower of influence, especially in the education and business sector. He has had a number of secondary schools, a number of training institutions, and he has provided knowledge to many young Ugandans, many of whom are now working. Dr. Gariwango's remains have been flown back home from Nairobi ahead of his burial happening on Tuesday 17th, January 2023 in Mbale City. Robert Nyango,